Shalom YouTube, all the beautiful people out there, this is Jaz Magnified, coming back with another video, uh, it's raining on my side of town, well it looks like it's about to stop right now though, but yeah, I'm just making another quick video, this video is titled Proof and Cure, so with that being said, let's get back to the subject matter at hand, okay, so I made my video earlier, I'm just going to touch on this a little bit, I ain't going to go no deeper in on it because the response from the guy is the same response from everybody else. You know, no proof or anything, you know. He went on the FBI website or some legal court website stating that uh, the straw man doesn't doesn't work. And uh, the people who did went to court and used it, they lost. But that's where anybody that go to court and do something, that, you know, they don't know how to do it, they're going to lose. You know, for instance, me, I went to my federal lawsuit, lost. I didn't know what I was doing. I went to my first child support hearing, lost. I didn't know what I was doing. I appealed that, lost. I didn't know what I was doing. But just because you lose something doesn't mean it doesn't really work. It doesn't mean that you lost. You see, if you know, if you do things the right way, if you know things, how to do it the right way. You see, because I also went back, then I won. Nah, I did it the wrong way the first time. So, the first few times... And I've tried somebody else's method, and I lost. What's wrong with that? Just because you lose doesn't mean, doesn't mean that it don't work. You know, it means you're doing it wrong. That's it. Switch it up. Do it the right way, you get off. And all the ones that's done the right way get results like me. The ones that don't do it the right way lose. Plain and simple. You know, that's what anything. So... They only gonna put the ones up there that people lost on, cause the ones that people won on, they never made it in the court. Like me, I never made it in the court, and I got proof for that too. You know, ask guys to provide proof like like this. You see, you know, none of them can provide proof that they doing what I'm doing. That's the whole thing. You know, I'm not on here to try to become a millionaire. You know, or even take their clients. Y'all can stay working with them. You know, you want to work with, work with them. That's cool. I don't care, man. You know what I mean? That's not what I came on here for. You know, I came on here to tell the truth. That's it. That's all. I'm going to tell it so much that I'm not going to get any more clients until I provide somebody else proof. And then after that, I'll get more people, you know. But until then, I ain't got no new clients. I'm working with the guys I got right now. And that's going to be that. You see? Micah was one. He provided proof. You see? I provided proof. But I want one more. You know? Out of the mouth of two or three witnesses. I'm one witness. Micah two witnesses. One more person be three witnesses. And after the rest, you know, glory and honor always to the most high, y'all. You see? But the guy's main argument was that I'm not a Hebrew Israelite. Because I don't speak Hebrew. And like that have anything to do with him providing proof that his case was dismissed or that he can even help you get off a child support. It don't have nothing to do with it. They always throw off stuff that has nothing to do with nothing. I'm talking about what type of name is y'all magnified. Bruh, what do that have to do with your case getting dismissed? What does that have to do with you helping people get off when you know you can't? Because you can't get yourself off. What the scriptures say? You got to get that boulder out of your eye before you can get the beam out of your neighbor's eye. Nah. It starts at home, bro. You got to do it for yourself first. You can't do something for, for somebody else that you can't do for yourself. What type of sense does that make? So I am whole tap. That's words to you, bro. So me going back and forth with you is pointless. Because you already lost. Until you provide proof. So, yeah. But let's get to reading this uh, cure. Cure. The act of healing. Restoration. To health from disease or the soundness after injury. So do child support cause injury? Yes, they do. You know, they take your property, they put you in poverty, you know, garnishing all your wages. You know, that's injury. That's injury done. You need to cure that. You see? But let's continue on. Under rule that a vessel and her owner must provide maintenance and cure for seaman. You hear that? Vessels, C-man. Okay, let's continue. Injured, 
or falling ill while in service. Remember guys, I made a video called Your Straw Man is a vessel. Your all caps name is a vessel. Where's it at? In the sea. You the sea man. Who what the what? The cure. Come on guys. I'm giving y'all the game, man. Just giving it right on the way. My video just man. You know. But like the Messiah spoke, man. He spoke in riddles, man. He just ain't tell him what to do. Those with eyes to see and ears to hear, they pick up. You see? And who would he come for? Who did you should come for? You who should came for the lost tribe of Israel. And that's who I'm coming for. You know? It ain't about me speaking uh Hebrew. You know, and all that, nah. Cause you don't have to speak Hebrew to beat child support. You know, so that argument is don't even make sense, bruh. But let's continue. Then it says, uh, cure is care, including nursing and medical attention during such periods as the duty continues. So cure is care. So you need them to care for the cause, for the for the injury they done to you, which means to cure. You see, dumb guys don't know how to cure. They don't offer a cure. They don't know what cure is. So let's and let's continue on. That's the case law. After the case law says, see also maintenance and cure, which is right there for all to see. But let's continue on. It says the right of a seller under UCC to correct. A non-conforming delivery of goods to buyers within the contract period. Again, stating that cure means to right the wrong. You see, all them guys provide cures. No, they're not. You got to provide a cure. They're not doing it. Now let's continue. Term used as in Chapter 13 bankruptcy proceedings. Adjustment of debts of an individual refers to provisions and repayment plans for curing defaults and debt obligations. Defaults and debt obligations. My goodness, man. My goodness, man. The guys that know who deal with me, they read this stuff and be like, bingo. You know what I mean? Right there for all to see, bingo. But they don't have eyes to see and ears to hear. You know what the scriptures say? How can one teach unless he be sent? You see? You can pass the book to people in the seal. Because they don't have no understanding. And that's all I'm saying, man. So me speaking in Hebrew and all that other nonsense that they want me to do. Has nothing to do with the facts of the matter at hand. So I don't have to prove nothing to them. But what I am doing is showing my followers the proof. And the truth. You know? And provide proof that they can't do what I can do. You know, so I'm just going to sit back. Like I said, I ain't taking no more clients until I provide proof of another person. And it's coming real soon, so guess what? Y'all get ready. So with that being said, let's continue on. Okay, as you guys can see on the screen, it's the word cure, right? Uh, just coming from the financial uh, terms. So with that being said, cure means to make good a default. To make good a default. Okay guys. So with that being said. Let's stroll up. Cure. To correct an error. To make a payment. Either in full or in part. On a liability. That is in default. Okay guys. So. You guys got to find the cure. And once you do that. It's a wrap. You know. So that's the whole thing. So like I stated earlier, man, I said what I had to say. It's proof here on out, you know. I've been providing proof since I got on here. You know, like I said, I wasn't going to come up here and try to get nobody else free if I'm not free. Only a, only a fool would try to do that, you know. That's blankly giving your money away. How do you give your money to somebody who, who blankly tell you they're not off but they can help you? Come on now. I never heard of, man, that's just foolishness, man. That's complete foolishness. But with that being said, let's get to this proof. Okay, guys, as you can see on the screen, more proof. So I like to give all glory and honor to the Most High Yah. Praise 
you, Yah. Hallelujah. So be praised to the Most High, Yah. Because he will be magnified. So with that being said, you have guys on here trying to discredit the, the straw man. You know, talking about some straw man theory, whatever that is. You know, I don't deal with the straw man theory. I deal with the straw man. You see, I provided proof. It's even in the Black Law Dictionary, guys. So I provided proof. You know, I, I do more than provide proof. I also provide proof to show you guys that them guys not doing what I can do. You know, they don't have the results like I have. And I provide my own results. You see? I'm not providing everybody else's results. And then can't provide my own. Nah, I provide my own results and other people's. And I got more results coming soon, guys. That's why I said I'm not going to take no more clients until I provide my third witness. You know, I was my first witness. Micah was the second witness. You know, my arc bike, Micah, was the second witness. And I got a third witness coming soon. But it's gonna be more after them three too. I mean after us, you know. So we got we got I got more coming. You know. We still working on big things. Shout out to my arc Micah, man, you know what I mean? You know. Shout out to him. And our brother uh Rolando. Shout out to him too. Shout out to them brothers, man. Some real guys, man. You know. I don't know them guys personally, but I do now because, you know, we, we almost said all the time, and I'm some some real brother that I have respect for, you know. I got respect for, and I got respect for other guys too, but I can't mention their name right now because we, we doing things. But they'll be on here speaking in a little bit. Believe me, it's coming, guys. So let's, uh, let's read this. DCSE. Case, show cause dismissal case. That's the case number. This was in my Gmail uh, inbox on May 4th by who? Miss Johnson from where? VDSS. That stands for Virginia Department of Social Services. So let's read what she had to say. My name is Miss Johnson, case worker with the Division of Child Support Enforcement, DCSE. I have been requested to advise you that DCSE previously requested a show cause rule which has been placed on the Fairfax Juvenile uh, Domestic Relations Court Docket for 5-5-2017 at 9 a.m., which will be dismissed by DCSE. So again, guys, if somebody tells you my way don't work, they a fool. You hear me? They a fool. I provide a more than enough proof, guys. So this is more proof. This is the end of the video for uh, proof and cure. You know, you need that cure. And once you get that cure, you get the remedy. And after you get the remedy, you got the proof. You see? So, man, y'all be blessed. Continue to fight. And for any other guys who are out here in the struggle and they fighting and they getting results, man, post it on my page, man. You know, I like to hear those testimonies, man. So post it on my page if you're getting real results, man, you know. That's what we all need to hear. We all need to know that, you know. You know, I'm not saying this is the only way to go by doing it. I'm just saying this is the way I did it. You see, I can only show you what I did. I can't show you anybody else's way. You know, if those other guys' ways work, then, hey, I'll big them up. You know, they just got to show me. They say, look, bruh, you know, y'all's magnified said it don't work. Boom, I got proof of work. I'll come back on YouTube and I congratulate the brothers. You know what I mean? Only thing I want them to do is provide proof. That's all, you know. That's it. That's all. And because I asked him to do that, I'm now become their enemy. Am I your enemy because I tell you the truth? Nah, I'm not your enemy because I tell you the truth. I'm just telling y'all the truth. If you don't like the truth, yeah, the truth hurts. But if you don't like the truth, that's on you, bro. And that goes to anybody, man. But with that being said, y'all continue to fight. Be blessed. You know, shalom, YouTube.